Hey lovelies! Well this review is just going to be on my Urban Decay's De Slick Makeup Setting Spray. That's almost a wee bit of a mouthful for me. So this product I actually got a few months back. I um, can't remember how much it cost me. I think it was 9 99 I cannot be sure. Um, and this isn't the full size. This is the small size product. I did decide to buy the smaller one because I thought if it doesn't work for my skin then there's no point in me having a full size bottle if I'm not going to use it and I have to say I really really like this product um, I had seen some people and got a few pieces of advice to try it before I put on my foundation I have to say that did not work for me whenever I do it that way my makeup actually just slides right off it's almost like I put a barrier on my skin and it's like water off a duck's back that's what it's like um, but whenever I put my makeup on and then put the spray on afterwards, it does really, really well. I have to say I like it for that. Um, there isn't a massive fragrance with it. Um, it says it's oil-free, paraben-free and has temperature control technology. Well, the reason I wanted that, and obviously an oil-controlled product, was because whenever my face sweats, it does get really oily and really shiny and everything. So I wanted something that was going to seal everything in. So that whenever I do sweat, I'm going to sweat through my makeup rather than just sweating it right off because that was a big issue for me. Um, and I was finding what was happening was I was using maybe a tissue or something and I would be patting all around here because this is where I would sweat the most. And then I would lick and I would have this bare patch here. And of course that doesn't look right. That's not going to look right on anybody's face. You don't want to have a bare patch on your moustache area. So this is really good. Now I wouldn't say it's a revolutionary product and it hasn't changed my life or anything. Um, but I do think that it's a really good buy. There are other versions of makeup setting sprays and I am going to try out some just to see if there's anything that I think is more amazing than this. But um, I really like this product. I do for the most part like Urban Decay products. Obviously as you've probably seen in my previous review. I don't like their naked skin foundation and um, it's too watery for me Um, it kind of just runs off my face even whenever I've tried to set it or anything but I do like their setting spray I like their eyeshadows I think they're a really really good company they come out with really good products Um, and this is one of them I do have their primer potion I have only got one at the moment I am gonna try one of the other colors just to see what I think before I do an actual review on that Um. But for the most part, I mean, to sum it up, I do love this product. So if you ever get a chance, obviously I do recommend if there's ever a trial size and you haven't tried a product before, go for the trial size first because you might as well spend less money and get a smaller product because if you're not going to like it, you don't want to be sitting with a full size and never be using it. Whereas if you buy the smaller product, then whenever you run out, you just buy the bigger one that time. So that's my advice. If you get a chance, try the smaller version and see what you think of it. And once again, as I say all the time, if you've tried this product, let me know what you think in the comments below. I hope this has been useful to you guys. If you've enjoyed this, let me know in the comments below and also give me a wee thumbs up because there's nothing I like more than seeing the amount of thumbs up I'm getting on these videos. I don't think I get enough. Please, look at this sad face. Hey, just for that sad face, I deserve a thumbs up. Anyway guys, I will see y'all soon. Love yous. Mwah. Bye.